Hello, and welcome to this video. I picked this up from the dollar store. I'm thinking, what can we do to make that look a little bit more attractive? I had an idea. Let me share it with you. What I did was, I painted the front side white and the other side red. You have to be careful when you're painting the edges. Sometimes the red gets onto the white. So, and now what do we do with this? I came across a lovely Valentine's Day tissue paper. Let me show you what I did. My, my idea was to paper mache this on the front. I take my Mod Podge, I put it here at the bottom, so when I put the tissue paper on, it will be anchored. Press it gently to get all the wrinkles out. Don't press too hard. There. It's anchored and I'm going to move my way up. Just a little bit at a time. That way we can keep control of the tissue paper. Gently, gently, gently. There we go. And we keep going till we're done. Okay. Keep control of your paper. Stretch it ever so slightly. Work out those wrinkles. There we go. Work them out as best you can. I think we can get this one done. There we go. There you are. And you'll let that sit for just a little while. Now what we want to do is mudge podge it on the surface. And use a little bit more. And this is an opportunity to work out some of those wrinkles. Don't get it too wet and don't press too hard. And make sure you get your Mod Podge right to the edges. Right, you'll see how important that is in just a minute. Now, 
Then after you let that dry, and then come to this. So what we want to do is get rid of all the paper in between. And because we paper uh, mod podge it to the end with our paper mache, we can gently pull it off and tear it off. And in some instances, to make a clean cut, take your filing and gently run down in one direction. And that will get rid of any raggeds. There. Then you do that all the way around. check our website for the finished product. Thanks for watching. Whatever you do, keep crafting. Bye for now.